The talking dog is yelling at me. Oh dear. Okay. So I don't think I can grab anything. Let's start just let's just start using items on the dog. Sir, I wonder if you might be interested in bribery? Bribery? <laughs> No, I, I'm, I'm actually not interested in robbing your town. Okay. What if I hit him with a stick? Sir, I wonder if you might be interested in... Bribery? Bribery? <laughs> I don't know if he's saying robbery and bribery, maybe? Bribery. Um, he doesn't want to be bribed. Sir, I wonder if you might be interested in... Bribery? Bribery? <laughs> yep, he's definitely saying bribery. Okay. Sir. Bribery? I'm just gonna try using everything on him. I just don't think it's gonna work. Sir. Bribery? Sir. Bribery? <laughs> I could cry. Okay, I'm crying now. Good sir, I want nothing from your town. I'm only searching for my lost daughter, Rosella. She was stolen by some form of dark magic, and now I fear I will never see her again. Oh, that's the saddest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> Enjoy your stay in Foldor, old lady. Be sure to take the faux shop with a grain of salt. <laughs> I hope you found your daughter. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, that works. The sky is falling! Never mind there, my lady. He's very silly. Huh. Silly people. In the in this town, I can't believe it. That that is, I've never heard of such a thing. Okay, China shop. Let's see. As suspected, there is a bull that runs the China shop. <laughs> Welcome to my shop, dear lady. I am Fernando Bullforth, proprietor. Good day, sir. Oh, it is not a good day. It is a terrible day. A black day. I'm sorry to hear that, Fernando. Is there anything I can do to help? Not unless you have found my treasure. Someone stole your treasure? treasure. How awful! Was it gold or gems? No, it was treasure, my precious china bird. I love my treasure more than all the stars in the sky. She is my only friend, and now... Now she's gone. Aww. <laughs> so we need to find a china bird for this guy, and then help us out. This looks like an item we can get. I what it is. Pardon me, good sir, but what is the price of that lovely mask? The price is 100 pieces of gold, my lady, but I'll let you have it for 80. I just don't care anymore. <laughs> That's a lot of gold. Unfortunately, I've no money. Thank you anyway, shopkeep. Let's look that up. Must be your bird was stolen was. from your shop right out of her cage? Yes. But I was taking a nap, and I did not hear her cries. Oh, the guilt. These things are so lovely. But I'm afraid even to breathe in here. It all looks so fragile. Right. Is there anything else to look at? That decorative mask does look and very nice. But I don't have any money. I don't have any money. So that's that's a problem. The sky is falling! What? The sky is falling! What's wrong, Chicken Little? Why do you think the sky is falling? Did you hear me, lady? I said the 
sky is falling! Jeez, calm down! I had no choice but to hear you, my lady. What makes you think the sky is falling? a little later for the Archduke's birthday party and masquerade ball. Now that sounds like fun. I imagine that's what that China mask is for, for the uh, masquerade ball. So let's go down this Look! road. The sky is falling! The sky is falling! Ah, then maybe you would prefer some of Professor Gluten's all-purpose extra sticky glue to put it back. I'll tell you why, my dear. It's because you don't get their attention. However, if you were to smack them in the head with this fine shillelagh... Oh! Fuck! A strange chicken. Okay, so we've got a crow. We've got some sort of, uh... I'll just examine all these things, and then I'll go into the, uh, faux shop. Is that a bird? Hello, little bird. Who are you? Go away! Hush, little one. Your friend Fernando is looking for you. He says he loves his little treasure more than all the stars in the sky. You've met him? Will you take me to him, please? Of course. Here, hop on my finger. Well, that's an easy puzzle. Okay, I have the, uh, the, the bird. I didn't even need to try to do anything. Just talk to the bird and you're good. Okay, let's talk to this bird. And we'll also talk to that snake. What a sweet little bird. Hello there, pretty. Hello, Dragon Brett. How can you be so rude? I'm a mockingbird, lady. What do you expect? Quick, go soak your head. Your brain is overheating. Okay. Not such a sweet bird after all. You smell like a pair of armored trousers after the Hundred Years' War. Cover your face, you're scaring the horses. Wow, that guy's a jerk. Okay, let's check the faux shop. Might as well. Since I'm on Busy on creating a pack of lies. Back soon. Huh, so I can't actually do anything in the faux shop. Good day, sir. I wonder if you might be able to help me. Of course I can help you, madam. What you need is a big jar of effervescent, a quick-acting dewberries revelant. It will cure what ails you and cleans your cookware as well. I am not ill, sir. And furthermore, I find your claim hard to believe. You do? Well, with Dr. Bullroarer's gullibility tonic, you'll believe anything. It's made with so much pure hooey that it won't just suspend your disbelief. It'll make it hover in midair. Never mind, merchant. I'll seek help elsewhere. Interesting. Yeah, well, he's just... Good merchant. A liar. I really would appreciate a moment of your time. A moment, you say? That will be two gold coins, my lady. Two moments for three coins. What a bargain. 
Whew. Okay, clearly he is charging money. <laughs> such outrageous prices. I haven't heard such outrageous prices since I called the hint line to figure out what to do next in this game. Maybe that's why they made the game so hard, so they could get more hint line money. Okay, so I'm going to go to this uh, bird here. I mean, I'll, I'll return the bird, obviously. That's what I have to do. I like putting the crown on top of her hair, so it looks like she's wearing a crown. That's cute. I know someone who'd really like to see you, Fernando. Who might that be, my lady? I cannot thank you enough, good lady. Here, allow me to present you with this. It is my newest acquisition, and I want you to have it. Thank you, Fernando. I will always remember you and Treasure. If you will excuse me, my lady, I must go spend some quality time with Treasure. Yes, tell me all about it, my little precious one. How nice! Okay, so now I have this mask. Kind of creepy looking mask, but... Hey, maybe I can use it to get rid... I mean, get past that werewolf, right? That will scare the werewolf? I don't think the mask is that creepy, but it still looks kind of creepy. It's a, it's, a, it's a crystal mask. Oh. Good evening, sir and madam. Do come right in. I feel like I would need that to get here into the, uh, into the masquerade. I feel like that's the puzzle. Okay, well, let's go to the final part of town. The part that I have to explore. Place. Oh, okay, so this is the only part of town we can go to. Huh. Oh, well. Oh, I probably have to use the mask on the queen first. What do you want? Well, I'm trying to find my daughter, Rosella, and... I'm just Oh, sure you are, lady. You're trying to get into the Archduke's birthday party, that's what. Well, you can't come in. You don't have a mask, and your face is bald. Blah! Wow. 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 Well, your face is nothing to write home about, sir. I thought my face was quite lovely. Okay, so that mask should help. Welcome, my lady! Wow, look at all the people here. So where am I? Okay, I'm here. That's probably the exit there. Doesn't look like I can talk to anyone. Checking to see if there's anywhere else I can go. Anything I can interact with? No, let's just go to the door. Happy birthday, Archduke Yip Yap! Thank you, my loyal subject! <laughs> <laughs> Because she's a disguise. It's very cute. Interesting. Okay. So, wow. Sneaking into the Archduke's area. Um, up or down? Down. Let's go down. This looks like a maze, doesn't it? Let's go down. And yeah, we're gonna go right. Oh, what the? She's upside down? Let's just 
just keep going across the staircase. Okay. Well, thank goodness that led to this door. Well, I think the world just got a new definition for tacky. Ouch! Oh, jeez! Wow! What a perfectly awful basin! Wow. Okay. Let's see. Look at the mirror. Ah! Funhouse mirror, huh? Let's see what this mirror does. What? Archduke Fifi, you look every bit as silly on canvas as you do in person. here yet. Nope, 
that's that. Okay. 